I'm a big spy movie fan, but that doesn't mean I want to be spied on, especially not by my operating system. There are ways to minimize the amount of information that flows back to Microsoft through Windows 10. Here we'll discuss four of them. App permissions, personalized advertising, Cortana, and OneDrive. Turning off permissions may affect how some apps work. Turn off the location permission in Maps, and it won't be able to find you. Makes sense. Click on the Start menu, then Settings. Select Privacy. Now click on Feedback and Diagnostics, change the feedback frequency to Never, and Diagnostic and Usage Data to Basic. Now you can manually choose the information you want made available, like location, camera and microphone, speech inking, typing, and calendar. Now let's adjust the personalized advertising section. Some may find this feature a little intrusive. The system learns your habits and tailors third-party ads to match your preferences. To disable it, go to Settings, then Privacy, and click on General. For the option that says, let apps use my advertising ID for experience across apps, turning this off will reset your ID, slide the toggle button to off. Next step, open up your browser and go to choice.microsoft.com forward slash en hyphen us forward slash opt hyphen out. Select off for personalized ads wherever I use my Microsoft account and for personalized ads in this browser. If you use an ad blocker or an extension, you may have to turn it off because the turn off in browser ad personalization feature selection may not appear. The Windows 10 handy virtual assistant Cortana makes her Canadian debut later this year. Cortana gathers a ton of information about you in order for Microsoft to personalize your experience. This includes your browser history. If you haven't asked for Cortana's help, no problem. She's already off. See the top option that says, Cortana can give you suggestions, ideas, reminders, alerts, and more? Slide the toggle to off. Almost there. Now go into Settings, then to Privacy, Speech, Inking, and Typing. Click the Stop Getting to Know Me button to stop the function. This will delete any collected data on your PC and stop dictation. If you don't want to store your files on the Microsoft OneDrive, simply click on the upward facing arrow found in the system tray on the right hand side. Right click on the OneDrive icon and select Settings. A new window will open. Uncheck Start OneDrive automatically when I sign into Windows. Many like the personalized experience that Windows 10 can provide. Some find it intrusive and want to protect their personal data from the prying eyes of Microsoft. With a few adjustments, it's nice to know you may have either with this new system. For ITBusiness.ca, I'm Jody Blinoff. Look for more Windows 10 videos in the article below.